Good hard look at the bow. Good morning, footage fans. It is Wednesday, June 8th. And I come to you today on the Staten Island Ferry. Why? Because I can. Well, the main reason is because I have to get tickets for opening night in Staten Island and Staten Island Yankees and Brooklyn Cyclones to the two minor league baseball teams that are played the Yankees and the New York Mets that play in the outer boroughs of New York. I take the ferry there and then take it back because this is the only direct route between Staten Island and Manhattan within within New York City. I guess it's a good time to vlog me to talk to you about New York City's transit system. Let's see here, we've got the A, the B, the C, the D, the E, the F, the G, the J, the L, the M, the N, the Q, the R, and the Z, plus three different shuttles. So that's, that's 14 lines, three shuttles, and the Staten Island Railway. That's, and those go to all, those go to the four boroughs that are not Staten Island, which is really the only way to get them to Staten Island once again. And there are other ferries to, to Liberty Island, to Ellis Island, for all the touristy folks who want to see the Statue of Liberty. I've done that once, that was a lot of fun, I actually did that a couple of years ago. There are the ferries to Governor's Island, open during the summer, so they have a lot of uh, cultural events there. Oh, we're moving. The boat is moving. There's also PATH, which goes from New York to New Jersey via Midtown and Lower Manhattan. Okay. Because I don't have the hat of choosing with me and uh, no other method of choosing a um, the person for a question, I'm going to ask all you guys, and, and if you want to put it in comments as well, how do you get around where you live? I don't take the ferry every day, obviously, because I don't live in Staten Island. Uh, oftentimes, I walk or I take the, um, the bus or the train. So, what do you guys take? Yeah. See you tomorrow.